Hello, welcome to another edition of Smart Customs here on YouTube. What you're looking at is a custom configured and commissioned Lindroid Star Wars A New Hope, Episode 4. You'll see that this droid is best known for its time in the Sandcrawler scene with the Jawas. The droid here has many custom pieces and it is now scale correct and movie correct to what was on screen. The manipulator arm was added from the extended universe, but it's what the client asked for. You'll see special details like the dome was made scale correct. It has the plating and the riveting. The eye stock has been fashioned to match what's on camera. The antennas are actually metal and they're fixed. The tread system down below is actually from the Treadwell droid system. Also a custom commission figure I did for the same client of the Treadwell. We wanted to use the same tread system and make it movie correct. What you'll see on this is that the dome is semi-transparent. So as it looks here, very dull matte finish as in the movie, but when you turn the lights on, you can still see them through the dome. You'll let it here turn around one more time. The manipulator arm is actually magnetized so that the claw peg can't be broken. It's now fully removable and can still articulate. What you're looking at now is the three pieces disassembled. They are magnetized so they click into place. The dome comes up without anything having to be removed, just the manipulator arm has to be sticking straight up. The base has a plate to hold the magnets, and we'll show you the lighting system of the Lindroid here in just a moment. But these are the three pieces disassembled. You can see there's rust, metal scrape wear, And there's the internal guts that is from the original Hasbro kit, but it's been modified, heavily modified actually, and painted. Here's a look at the droid with the lighting system started. It has multiple lighting sequences. This is the slow pulse. And you can see each part of the internal component was painted to match the lights. So we're going to show you a quick look at how the thing gets put back together. There's a peg and hole and magnets that keep the the body aligned on it and then as we as it turns around I'll be putting the dome on I'll put the manipulator arm straight up and then as it comes down you'll hear a nice click and that sets it in place it can still rotate around its base the manipulator arm still works and you can see the lights coming through. It's easier with the lights off to see them in, in place. I'm actually going to turn the light off here just for a second. see them pulsing underneath there and like I said there's multiple light sequences for this but this added a, a whole different level to this droid being able to have those lights on and the batteries are replaceable well thanks for watching this edition and seeing this custom figure for the Lin droid from Star Wars A New Hope best known in the Jawa Sandcrawler scene. Thank you. There's more to come. Bye for now.